Doctor. It's hard to believe, but we are finally here at FCBM Friday number 30. And boy, I have a lot of stuff to show off. Um, same format as last week, and I think this will be the format I do, is... Well, actually, this is a little different. I've opened up every single piece of mail through today, Friday, to see if any of them are trades or not. If they are trades, then I have sent the person's trade out. If they aren't trades, then I have left them alone. If it's just free cards, then I have left them alone so that when I open them up on camera here, my reactions are genuine. So, but if they are trades, then I open ahead of time and, well, send their half the trade out. So, I think that this format works pretty well. Um, enough chit chat, let's get into it. This, oh wow, this is cool. This comes from Hawaii, this little thing here. And this was a trade. Let's see if I can get the little note out. And voila. Uh, this is on a St. Jude Children's Hospital uh, piece of paper. And it says, from Chaos Diamond. Uh, and then it says, high school, I'm your number one fan. Now, uh, hold on, what does it say? Mm, something is very perfect. Skull is very handsome. Sad as a is very pretty. And this is obviously from Chaos Diamond. And this was a trade for this holographic darkness energy from Call of Legends. And the card itself is just fine. It's just in a lot of tape and stuff like that. But it's in mint condition, so very happy to have knocked this off my once list. Now I think I'm only missing like three cards from Call of Legends, way lower than like the dozen or so from earlier this year. So I'm very happy with that. I think I should be able to just pick up the rest of them now. So thanks Chaos Diamond for the awesome trade. I haven't gotten your return address yet to know where to send the cards to, but as soon as you reply with that, then I will send your half the trade out. Let's keep going to this one right here, which comes from, I'm not entirely sure, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, the, uh, oh, I think it comes from Vermont, uh, it looks like an IT, but I think it's a VT, so, yeah, and this is an FCBM, so free cards by mail, uh, people have been asking what all these different uh, abbreviations mean. FCBM stands for free cards by mail and that's basically where you send me cards without asking for anything in return. Uh, TCBM is traded cards by mail where we arrange the trade ahead of time and then you send me your trade and I show it off and send out mine. So yeah. Anyway let's see if I can't find the note in all this. I think this is the note. Let's see. Hi my name is Leon, I think your videos are cool. I can't wait for your future videos. I sent some Pokemon cards and a picture I drew at Blastoise. Hope you like it. Sincerely, Leon, and then his email address is down there. So we have this custom Pokemon card right here that I'll show off first. And this is a, wow, look at that. That's a Zippy EX, HP 180. Pound, attack can only be used one time. Does 300 and Zippy attack, which I guess can be used an infinite amount of times, does 100,000, which... Man, I, I just realized the other day, I'm going to hit 100,000 subscribers sometime by the end of the summer. I'm I'm stoked. That's amazing. Only two other TCG PokeTubers have ever reached that milestone before. Po Primetime Pokemon and Unlisted Leaf. I, I'm, I'm having a hard time believing it, but I just might be the third person who does Pokemon TCG primarily to hit that mark, which is absolutely amazing. But anyway, that'll be going in my custom Helioptile collection. We also have... Three Helioptile cards for me to add to my normal collection. And I'm assuming this is the drawing of... Wow, this is a good drawing, too. We have Blastoise, and the camera doesn't do it justice. Um, I wish I could do my lighting better, but I just can't. But yeah, that's a beautiful drawing. Thanks so much. Uh, Leon, was it? Yeah, Leon. Uh, definitely going into my drawing drawer, and these are going into my binder. So, let's see. Um, should, uh, hold on. Organizing stuff behind the camera. Sorry, guys. This will obviously be more than one part. Uh, it always is, unfortunately. Hopefully, when my um, when my limit lifts in June, then I'll be able to fit all these in a, only one video. But until then, we just gotta do with what we have, deal with what we have. Anyway, let's go to this, which comes from New Jersey. And this was, um a trade, so that's awesome. Anyway, um, we should have our note here. 
trade here and then extras. So let's go to the note. Yeah, here we go. Um, hey Skull, thanks again for trading with me. Hopefully you can sign the Kingler card I sent, stamps included, and please send it back. Thanks from Jelly. And I did sign your Kingler. Thank you for the stamps too. It's really not necessary to send stamps or anything when we arrange a trade and you want for me to sign some cards because I'm going to be paying for return postage anyway. So uh, I know it's a little confusing, but if you are doing a trade with me, no, you don't have to include return postage. So uh, just... Yeah, remember that. But of course, if you uh, don't trade with me and you want me to sign a card, then please include return postage. It just makes things way easier for me. Uh, let's just go ahead and look at the extras. I really love that sleeve. Um, that's from the professor program, if I remember correctly. So, oh, this is awesome. Okay, this is one of the extras. We have Skull EX. <laughs> oh, look at that art. It has 300 HP. Uh, Zap Fire Cannon does 60, and then Zippy Storm does 50. If Helioptile Tiles played your next turn, it does another 100. That's awesome. And another extra was, ooh, um, beautiful Full Art Shaman EX from Radiant Collection. And then our actual trade is what I'm most excited for. Look at this awesome Typhlosion EX from Unseen Forces. Oh man, such a beautiful card. I'm very excited to be knocking cards off my once list, especially right now. I'm down to only one page of cards that I'm looking for. Um, and then all my ultra rares will be done after that page is all knocked off. Afterwards, I'll be looking for hollows and stuff like that. So, uh, But man, only one page left of ultra rares that I'm looking for. Uh, I think when I first started doing a trade binder or... When I first put up a once list, it was something like uh, three and a half pages or something like that. So now I'm down to just one, a little less than one actually. So I'm extremely excited. And it's thanks to you guys who are willing to trade me cards like this. And just look at that beautiful art. Can't wait to throw that in my binder to add to my collection. So thank you. Um, didn't Oh, Jelly. Thank you, Jelly, for the awesome stuff. And I did, of course, sign the Kingler and sent your stuff out already. So hopefully you've got that. Anyway, uh, we can keep going. We have plenty of time. We have this thing with the awesome Do Not Bend art. Oh, wait, no, that's just that's just letters. My bad. Uh, and this comes from Ohio. And inside, I can't remember if this was a FCBM or a TCBM. Uh, no, this was definitely a TCBM. So we have Trade, Extra, and then the Note, which I will read off right now. Uh, it says, Hey, school. My name is X, and here is my side of the trade. Also, I noticed I had something you need, so I sent that too. Also, if you have any extra Litleos, I collect those. Thanks, and have a nice day. Um, P.S. Tell Sad as I said hi. Also, she should be in more videos. I agree, she should be in more videos, but she's still in school. I'm not, so she's always tired. And unfortunately, I did try to look for some Litleos for you, but um, would you believe it or not, I actually don't have any. Um... Uh, um, I traded, I've gotten rid of almost all my extra flash fire cards. Beyond that, uh, there was only like one or two printed in Phantom Forces, and I didn't really collect that set too much. Anyway, uh, let's show off the extra first. Um, let's see if we can't get this out and show it off. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah. Um, first of all, we have this fake Dark Claw. And I know it looks extremely real, but there's a few giveaways for it. One, look at the back. You see how the border there is bleached into the rest of it. But the biggest giveaway is right there. You see right next to the darkness symbol in the description, Pokemon isn't capitalized. Uh, they never allow something that huge to slip through. So, yeah, thanks for the extra, but it is a fake. This, however, is not. <laughs> um, uh, ironically, I got this as an extra before this as a trade came through. So I do have an extra darkness energy now. I'm going to go between them and see which one is more mint, but I think they're both pretty much gem mint, or at least near mint mint. So yeah, so <laughs> thanks for the awesome extra. And like I said, it did come first. So if this one had never come through, then I would have been fine. But I do have an extra now, so uh, I'll stop it there. So now we go to the trade, which I will take out of its sleeve right now. And our trade was for this hollow 
fire energy from Call of Legends. I think the only hollow energy I'm missing now is the uh, metal energy, which I believe I've arranged to trade for. I'm not quite sure. Even if not, I think that's one of the easier ones to get. I know the darkness energy is definitely the hardest one. I think it goes for like 10 or 15 bucks on eBay. Hollow energies from Call of Legends, really hard to go for. Let's just put it that way. So thank you so much for this trade. I've already sent your half of the trade out, and hopefully it should be here by now. So once again, thank you so much. Uh, X is how you wanted to be called. So let's see um, what's left. Uh, I think I'll just go to this now, this big thing. Hopefully I can get through everything in the next few minutes. We shall see. Oh, and it comes from New York, in New York State. This was a trade, but we also have some awesome stuff here. Uh, Dear Skull. Thank you for the trade. That really helps my promo collection grow and happy to get you one step closer in completing Legends Awaken. I also send FCBM. Please sign the Charizard. My current YouTube account is Nicholas Joseph, but that didn't work out very well. So if your viewers watch this, please subscribe to my other channel coming out in May called The Primal Charizard. Sincerely, The Primal Charizard. And we got the awesome Helioptile drawing there. That's just the cutest thing ever. And, well, no, no reason to... Uh, Keep you guys in suspense for the trade, which was for this Azelf level X. This was the last ultra rare I needed from Legends Awaken. Very happy to have it. I haven't completed the set yet, but I have at least gotten all the ultra rares, which would make completing the set a lot easier now. And I believe I already sent your half of the trade back, uh, along with a card you wanted me to sign. So yeah. And then we also have some extra cards here. It says open first. And it's going to take me a while to go through everything, so I'll just... Um, I'll not really talk, but uh, we got a lot of old school cards here, though. I really love that Nidoran, that Magikarp, the Bulbasaur, Rapidash. You know, I can say them as I go. Never mind. Ninjask, Onyx, uh, Meowth, Shinx, Finanet, Magneton, Mankey, Team Galactic's Mars, Masquerain, Horsey, Pelipper, Caterpie, Bisharp, Machoke, Recycle, Pillowswine, Lapras, Crustle, Magikarp, Derp, Girder, um, Psyduck, Charmander, my very first card ever, Magnemite, Meryl, and Nidoran again. Awesome. And then we're going to end with this thing that says surprise. What could it be? Ooh, I love this. Um, I wonder if the camera can pick it up. Yeah, look at the uh, pattern on the back of this. That That's just awesome how that looks. Unfortunately, you cannot play with a, a sleeve like this in the Pokemon trading card game. It has to be either a Pokemon-related sleeve, like um, officially printed thing that has Pokemon on it, either English or Japanese, doesn't matter, or it needs to be a solid colored back. So patterns like this, unfortunately, are not allowed. Still cool, though. And it's obviously backwards, so pull it out. Take it out, and wow, that's beautiful. Rayquaza EX, uh, the Diamond and Pearl promo. So, thank you so much, uh, Primal Charizard, for the trade and for all the awesome extras. And thanks, everyone, for all the stuff that you sent so far. I still have a few things to go through, so come back tomorrow for FCBM Friday, number 30, part 2.